Yes lads, how you all doing? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now today boys and girls, I'm going to you guys the Leeds United versus Leicester match preview. So the boys and girls, Leicester are now back in Premier League action once again after course Thursday night's disappointing result to say the least against Spartak Moscow in the Europa League where you know we drew 1-1. Could have won it, should have won it. It wasn't to be an overall, a very, very frustrating game on Thursday night at the King Power. However, our attention switches straight back to Premier League action. And once again, Leicester are on the road once again. It's match day 11 of the new Premier League season. And Leicester travel down to Ellen Road to take on Leeds United. And it's set to be a very, very competitive game between two sides who at the moment... I'm not looking too good. But, you know, if Leicester do actually, you know, decide to turn up in tomorrow's game against Leeds, no disrespect to Leeds United... We should get a pretty comfortable win, but the chances of that happening in Leicester actually turning up tomorrow, who knows? But back to our opponents for tomorrow's game, Leeds United. Last time out for Leeds United, they picked up a 2-on win on the road at Carrow as they beat Norwich 2-1 in a big Premier League win for the Whites. And of course, for Leicester, last time out in the Premier League, we had to suffer a 2 defeat to Arsenal where... We could have got a win from that as well, but obviously it didn't happen. The two sides come together, boys and girls, this Sunday at Allen Road. And it's set to be a very, very good game between two sides who, you know, are in very mixed forms right now. But let's hope, you know, Leicester can actually get the win. Who knows? But, um, yeah, if you can get a win tomorrow, that would be massive. So, with all that being said, boys and girls, and without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. Let's talk Leicester and Leeds, and let's get straight into the match preview. Right then, so as always, starting things off then, my thoughts going into tomorrow's game. Leeds United then away from home tomorrow for Leicester, and overall, you know, it's going to be a difficult game. Of course, so far this season, Leeds United haven't been on the greatest of form, but, you know, it's always a difficult place to go at Ellen Road. They'll definitely create a good atmosphere, and, you know, that would be very difficult to play in for Leicester. Leicester, especially in those first 15 to 20 minutes or so where you know Leicester are most vulnerable and you know if Leicester play like we did in the first 20 minutes against Arsenal concede two there is no chance of Leicester getting back into that game because the atmosphere at, at Allen Road if they go two and up will be absolutely electric but in my opinion the main thing in tomorrow's game is that Leicester needs to play our game set the tempo and play our football tomorrow away from home and if Leicester can execute that and play our game I'm pretty confident that Leicester can get the three points if we just wipe out that pressure from Leeds early on settle down the crowd I think you know Leicester could cruise to a simple victory but overall it's probably not going to happen Leeds will definitely make it a very tough game for Leicester tomorrow we need to go into battle be competitive win the 50-50s and really get on those second balls because it's going to be a very powerful game tomorrow and, and both sets of players need to be on it from minute one Leicester won't have much time on the ball at all tomorrow we need to be quick decisive with our passes get through the lines quicker not, not like we did against Thursday against Spartak Moscow where we're playing at like zero miles and now we need to get just get the ball moving play it into like some Yuri Tillemans James Madison in midfield make things happen and get that very shaky Leeds United defence going into tomorrow's game my confidence levels I'm pretty 50-50 to be honest like I said it's going to be a big test for Leicester tomorrow but you know if Leicester can come through that and we fully have the ability to do so it will be a massive three points heading into the next international break but as always boys and girls let me know how you guys are feeling going into tomorrow's game let me know in the comment section down below Leicester fans Leeds United fans let me know how you guys are feeling and approaching tomorrow's game down below so then moving things on it's now time to look at some stats between Leeds and Leicester going into tomorrow's game Leeds are looking to win consecutive league games against Leicester for the first time since December 1999 Leicester have won four of their last five league visits to Leeds as many as they had on their previous 16 trips to Ellen Road Leeds three leading Premier League goal scorers last season have only contributed one goal between them so far in the 2021 to 2022 Premier League season. And for Leicester, we've conceded 18 set-piece goals since the start of last season. Only Crystal Palace have let more in in, in that time period. So we're going to, boys and girls, that's some interesting stats between Leeds and Leicester then heading into tomorrow's game. Yeah, moving things on then, it's time to jump straight into my predicted lineup. But just before we do that, it's now time to look at the key headlines from Brendan Rodgers' pre-match press conference yesterday at Seagrave, where, where he went through the latest Leicester injury news. Brendan Rodgers confirms that Harvey Barnes and James Madison should be fine this weekend after a Recovering from a sickness bug. Yannick Vestergaard has also contracted the bug, which is why he missed the game on Thursday against Spartak Moscow. And Brennan Rogers speaking about the current form. He says it's okay. We're six points off the Champions League places and without hitting our top form yet, we're still within touching distance. There's lots of room for improvement. 
And finally, Brendan Rodgers speaking on Leeds United. You know what you're going to get. They're going to be physical. They're going to run. They'll, they'll be looking to bring that game to their supporters. This game is where you need to fight. So yeah, lads, there are the main headlines then from Brendan Rodgers' pre-match press conference yesterday at the Leicester training ground in Seagrave. Of course, the main headlines there, James Madison and Harvey Barnes will hopefully be returning back to the side. Yeah, as always, boys and girls, just before I get into my predicted lineup, what side should Brendan Rodgers go with for tomorrow's game against Leeds United? Let me know in the comment section down below. Should we see a change in formation? Who's going to start tomorrow? Is Brendan, is Brendan Rodgers going to make some changes? And what changes do you guys want to see made in tomorrow's game at Ellen Road? Let me know your thoughts down below. So then starting things off then with my formation going into tomorrow's game. I'm actually going to switch the 4-3-3 formation. I think, you know, it's time to scrap the 5 at the back formation. It hasn't really worked. You know, defensively, even with 5 players just at the back, hasn't done too well. We are limited players going forward. So for me, we just switched back to the 4-3-3 formation. Yeah, starting things off then the goal. Of course, we'll be going with Kasper Schmeichel. Moving into the back four then, starting things off then with the two centre backs. For me, I'm going to go in with Kegler Sunchu and Johnny Evans to be the two centre backs. Yes, it's slightly harsh on on Daniel Amata, he has been fantastic, but I think you know, Siunchin Evans do work slightly better alongside each other. And of course, when Fafan returns back to the side, he'll probably slot in alongside Evans instead of, of, of course, Siunchin. And of course, the two fullbacks right inside will be going with Timothy Castagna, probably one of our most reliable players. On the left, we'll hopefully see Ricardo Pereira turn back to the side. Because, you know, Ryan Bertrand was pretty shambolic on Thursday. And for me, Luke Thomas, need, he, he, to be honest, he, he, he does need a loan. So for me, hopefully Ricky can start in that left-back role. If not, we'll probably see Luke Thomas, or of course, either Ryan Bertrand. So then moving things on then into the midfield three. Starting things off then in the holding role. This is difficult. Do we either go with Samare or Wolfred and Diddy? Of course, and Diddy came on against Sparta at Moscow. Samare has started a lot of games. Oh, is, it, is it worth the risk of throwing Diddy into his first Premier League game in over a month? against Leeds United in a very competitive game. So for me, I think Samari will start, but we definitely could see Ndidi off the bench. Moving ahead, we'll be going, of course, with Yuri Tillemans. Simple as that, Yuri has to start probably the most important player in our team right now. So yeah, Yuri for me, and of course, in the camera, in behind the striker, we'll be going with James Madison to return back to, to the side. Of course, we missed him heavily on Thursday night, so hopefully Madison is fully fit going into the game, and hopefully he can, he can return into that number 10 role in behind the strikers. And finally, then, boys and girls, moving into the front three then for tomorrow's game. Starting off on the left hand side, I'll be going with Harvey Barnes. Once again, a massive miss for Leicester on Thursday night, so fingers crossed Harvey Barnes can return back to the side. Starts just starting that left back, and really attack that weak Leeds United defence because that is very gettable at. Right hand side we'll be going with Adi Mola Lutman. When he came on didn't really look himself. Yes he won the penalty but apart from that didn't really do too much. So hopefully Lutman can have an improved performance on that right hand side and of course the lone striker will be going with Jamie Vardy. Yes he missed a penalty on Thursday night. Very rare but I think you know it's time to just switch back to Vardy up top by himself. If it doesn't work he can switch things up or potentially of course off the bench we've got options of Ian Acho and Pat Sandaka as well. So there you go, boys and girls. That's my prediction on them for tomorrow's game. Let me know your thoughts on that in the comment section down below. But yeah, ending things off then, my score prediction going into tomorrow's game. Once more, I'm going to hand it straight to you guys in the comment section down below. What are you guys thinking for tomorrow's game? Score predictions, let me know down below. For me, I'm going to go with a Leicester win. I'm going to try and stay positive. I'm going to go with a Leeds United 1, Leicester City 3. I think we will get the win. It's going to be a close game. I think it's going to be 2-1 for large periods of the game. And Leicester will finish things off with, with, with like a counter-attack goal towards the end of the game. Goal score rise. I think Leicester will take the lead through James Madison. Leeds, Leeds will get level through probably Dallas or someone. Of course, Leicester will go back in front through Harvey Barnes. And to end things off, we'll go with a, a Pats and Dacker goal off the bench. Yeah, but it's 3-1 tomorrow for Leicester. That is my score prediction. You know, I'm fairly confident. I'm going to try and stay up optimistic. I guess it, it will be a massive three points to Yeah, as always, let, let, just let me know your score predictions for tomorrow's game down below. So, the boys and girls, is that then for today's video? Of course, in today's video, I bring you guys the Leeds United versus Leicester match preview and predict lineup for tomorrow's trip to Ellen Road, a massive game for Leicester in the Premier League. If you guys have enjoyed today's video, let me know by dropping a like, subscribe as well to the channel. If you guys have not already, and like I said a few times already, most importantly, let me know your thoughts and opinions, predicts, lineup, score predictions, all in the comment section down below for tomorrow's game, boys and girls. Fingers crossed Leicester can return back to winning ways in the Premier League tomorrow with hopefully a big three points against Leeds United. Yeah, boys, I'm a sportser, and I'll see you guys very, very soon in the next video. Peace, guys.